Okay, now that I have the switch installed, I'm going to show you how to program it to the actual app. So you want to make sure that the light's blinking slowly, green, if not, take off the cover and there's a reset button there. But I got the app here and I'm going to launch it. Let me turn down the screen brightness so you can see it better. Okay, so we have it there on the app. You simply press on the add. It tells you that you should be on a 2.4 network and not a 5. So let me actually go check that out because I think I'm on my 5G one. So hold on. Okay, I just switched networks. Now I'll just give it some time to connect. There it is. So now I'm going to hit next. So now it's searching for devices. And there it is. So do you want to add it? Yes, allow. So now it's asking you for the key. Uh, this key is located inside the little instructional brochure or it's actually on the device in the pack. So if you don't have it, it's there. So it's, it takes it and now it's pairing it. And there it is, it has been added. So now from here, uh, as you saw the lights flickered, it turned on and off a little bit. So you name it, whatever you want to name it, you put it in the room you have it in. I have mine in my kitchen. Uh, type, it's a light. Uh, including your favorites. And done. So now it's here. Now I can go to my my home app. It should be the As you can see there. So that, there it is. It's pretty simple to set up. Uh, then you have it in your favorites if you want it in your favorites. If not, then it's in your actual home. Uh, you have your devices that you have enabled, and there it is. Oh, but one thing I also wanted to show you that it it also works without having uh, the app on. So if you turn it on here you can still turn it off here and vice versa. If I turn it on here, I can still shut it off here so it's not dependent only on your device. But there it is, quick demo on how to set it